Breaking news. Asari Dokubo in critical condition looks paralyzed with a stroke. Here are the news in details. Wonderful people of Biafra lovers of freedom all over the world. You are welcome to Biafra Unite channel slash television this very moment. Today's date is 3rd of May 2024 and I have a video clip for you. Dear friends and lovers of freedom, I want you to pay very good attention to this very news. Because it's very, very important, I can assure you, my people, the time for every individual who has spoken ill against Mazi Namdi Kano, against Mazi Simon Ekba, and above all, against the Biafra liberation struggle to gather right here because I have a message for all of you. I have a very, very strong and all-important message for you. If you have ever spoken ill against Mazinam de Kano, if you have ever caused Mazinam de Kano, if you have ever come against the liberation of the people of Biafra, the restoration of Biafra land, I want you to pay very good attention to this very broadcast because it is very, very important and I will advise you moving forward. I will advise you for the next line of action because you are a canal-minded individual, then you believe that what we are doing is for canal-minded individuals like you. You cannot reason what we are doing canally. You can't do that. If I never be for more, if you are not in the spirit, if you do not operate in the same frequency, you cannot understand what we are doing. You can't understand it. Some of you go on social media, you rant, you talk ill against Mazinam de Kano, Machukoki Kabia Matelumano. You mock him, you threaten him. I will mention few names and, of course, advise them. But before that, let me play this very 14 minutes clip of video for you. I want you to pay attention watch this very video and of course listen to my analysis because it's going to be very very critical and of course a very important message to all of these individuals that i will be mentioning their names moving forward those who have in one way or the other mocked and threatened mazinam de kano watch the video pay attention don't go nowhere we still have more in the kitchen now, if you look through this place, the person you are seeing here, I want you to follow the mouth. This person you are seeing here is Asari Dr. Look at him. Look at him here. I want you to look through this place in between this uh, pillar and this wall here. I don't know. This is this looks like a vehicle. I think this is a airport uh, vehicle. Now, look in between here. You see Asari Dr. The way they held him. I want you to see. You see? And this is in a foreign land. This is a foreign land. He has been flown out of the country, out of the zoo, for a medical treatment. Look at him. You see how they are holding him. He can't even walk. He can't walk. That's why I use the title, Looks Paralyzed with Stroke. I'm not certain. I don't know what it is. I don't know the nature of his illness. And they let me make this very, very clear that I am not mocking him in this condition. So you don't say, eh, nobody knows tomorrow, it could be your turn tomorrow. I understand that nobody knows tomorrow. So I am not in any way mocking a solid doctor with sickness. No. Actually, the main reason why I'm making this very record is for the moment is to send a great message, a very important message to other people which I will be mentioning their names and if necessary, play some of their videos during the course of this very broadcast. So it is very, very important and, of course, imperative for all of them to pay very, very good attention to this. You can see your Asari Dokobo. Your Asari Dokobo is today a person that cannot even walk on his own without the help of two individuals. You can see it. You can see through the video. Now, having said this, let me send a great message to everybody. Before sending this very message, I want to remind you the activities of Asari Dokobo so far. Asari Dokobo has been a thorn on the flesh of all Biafrans, especially not all Biafrans, I cannot say all Biafrans, let me say all Igbos. Asari Dokobo has been a thorn 
on the flesh of every Igbo man. Asari Dokubo has been a thorn on the flesh of Mazi Namdekano. Asari Dokubo has been a thorn on the flesh of Mazi Simon Ekpa. Even though he has no influence, even though he can't do anything, even though he only rant, he only rant, he can't do anything. But his utterances and his idiocy on social media has constituted nuisance, uncontrollable nuisance on social media, distracting a lot of people. As if that is not enough, Asari Dokubo has found his way into the midst of DOS, into the camp of DOS, and the wife of Mazinam Dekano, including the expelled criminal lawyer, Ifajune Jofo. Asari Dokubo found his way to mingle with not just only the wife of Mazinam Dekano, the, ex, the previous, the ex-wife, because I'm, I'm very, very certain she's getting a divorce once Mazinam Dekano is out. I'm very, that one I can give you guarantee. Mark my word today. Today is 3rd of May, 2024. She is getting a straight divorce without any compensation once Mazinam Dekano is released. That one I can guarantee you. So, Asari Dokubo opened his mouth. Listen, because here we don't do bogus, we don't do bogus allegations. We don't lay allegations on innocent people. Listen, let me reiterate. Asari Dokubo opened his own mouth, his mouth, and said that the wife, he, he was in a meeting. He was in a meeting with the wife of Mazin Namdekano, Ifanye Jofo, and the family member, the parents of the wife of Mazin Namdekano. That was a video. I'm sure everybody watched it. So you don't have to tell me eh, where is the video because that video trended more than one month. That very video trended more than one month on social media. So I believe all Biafran saw it. He said it that he had a meeting with Mazinam the Kano's wife, Ifanye Jofo, and the parent of Mazinam the Kano's wife, where they were telling him how, you know, of course, how successful their operation was. And this thing happened a few months after the kidnap and rendition of Mazinam de Kano to the zoo. Now, Asari Dokubo has gone on to threaten to take the life of Mazinam de Kano. He has gone on to threaten to deal with Mazi Simon Ekma. He has sent his Asawana Asawana terrorist organization or terrorist group to Imo State in collaboration with Hopu Zodema and slaughtered innocent Biafrans until the Biafra Liberation Army took charge of Imo State and sent many of them to judgment while others ran back to Bayasa and River State. Now, Asari Dokobo, I don't have to mention his activities, you all know. But because of this, his situation, remember that Mazenam Dekano is still in the DSS custody, even though he's having issues with his health because of his condition and also the beating that he received from the terrorist organization that kidnapped him in Kenya. But at least, I can categorically tell you today that Mazinam Dekano is healthier than Asari Dokubo because nobody holds Mazinam Dekano like this or even assist him to walk. Now, having said this, I want to show you a video. I want to show you a video in order to remind you. Now, you all know this boy on the screen, right? This very boy called Shemukuti. There's a comment or statement he made against Mazinam Dekano, against the life of Mazinam Dekano. And I'm about to play it right now. That particular place where he made that comment about Mazinam Dekano or against Mazinam Dekano's life. I want you to pay attention. A question I've asked them over two years, 18 months ago. Now, in this is video, you begin to show disrespect to my papa. He said, my, my father like chicken. This I said, first of all, let me this I said. My father died a free man, surrounded by his family. But I guarantee you, now the can I say, like a chicken. My father died a free man, surrounded by his family. But I guarantee you, now the can I say, like a chicken. Did you hear that? He said, I guarantee you, he guarantee us that Mazinam the Kanu will buy inside cell like a chicken. I don't care about his fight. With the Prime Minister of the Biafra Republic government next time as Simon Ekba, I don't care about his fight with him. But my concern is for him to sit in his room and make that comment against Mazinam Dekano. That is my problem.
with him. So anybody who knows him, anybody that knows him, should tell him there is something we call guinea fowl. In Igbo language, we call it okwa. So okwa nekweba na rokuko, no kwa wan negi. Guinea fowl should look at where they are roasting chicken because they are in one family. Then there's another boy called Ijele. He said his name is Ijele Speaks. Ijele Speaks has made many or unbelievable comments, utterances, threatening the life of Mazin Americano as well. Ijele Speaks, Ibo Nibo, you are an Igbo man. This one, I don't have to, you know, translate it for you because you are an Igbo man. Although I'm aware that he is in cell at the moment because of his case with Ebukobi. You threaten to buy him as an Amdekano. Also, just the same way this idiot here said. I don't care, you may have issues with us, no problem. You may have issues with the way we are fighting for freedom, no problem. But for you to open mouth and say that Mazinam the Kano will buy, there's a time he even made a casket. He made a casket and posted it on social media saying that that is him. He, he himself, not Mazinam the Kano, but himself. You may think it's over because it's been a long time that you did that. But I want to tell you, Look at Asari Dokobo. Of course, he may recover. He has been flown outside of the country. He may recover and come back. But I want to tell you, it is not over yet. Once you bless Israel, you will be blessed. If you cause Israel, cause shall be unto you. Thank you, my people. And make it go viral.